Good Things Foundation aims to improve people's quality of life through access to digital technology and skills training. We gain funding from external sources to support vulnerable people in the community through the help of online centres. Funding partners often want to target specific groups of people in the community, such as those with disabilities or those with children. These separate work streams are given specific titles, such as Digital Lifeline or Let's Get Digital. Recording the impact of such support on the lives of beneficiaries is an important part of the process. This information allows us to improve our programmes, report to funders and influence future funding partners to sustain projects. For funded projects, it's required that you use our reporting system in order to receive payments. The data collection tool used is called Capture It. The aim of this short video is to introduce you to the Capture It system. I'll show you where you can find Capture It, what it looks like and the types of questions you'll be asked to answer. Each project will require you use the Capture It system at specific points during the project. Entries will be required for each individual supported. All individual personal information will be anonymised and aggregated. First, let's look at opening Capture It and selecting the individual you want to record support for. To open the Capture It system, you first need to log into your Centre Learn My Way account. Here I've logged into my account and I'm on the Tutor homepage. Next, select the Learner Management tab. If you can't see this, ask your project lead to enable Tutor Access for you. Once the page loads, start by selecting the learner you're recording details for. I've created a fictional learner called Mo Smith and I'll use the search feature to find that record. When you type the name in, you'll see it appear at the bottom of the screen. If you can't find the learner when you search, you can create an account for them using the Create New Learner button, but you should ensure they're aware you're doing this. Next, I want to select Mo Smith from the list of learners. This will open their learner management page. We can see the Capture It option is shown in the top right of the screen. If I move over the Capture It option, it displays the list of projects for my centre. You need to select the project that you are working on. You might only have one or two projects listed depending on what your centre is funded for. I'm going to open HMRC Advice and Support. This opens the Capture It reporting page for that project. Now I'll talk a little bit about using the Capture It system to record individual support. The first thing to note is the box asking you to indicate you've gained the individual's informed consent regarding the use of their personal data. Read this carefully before selecting the box. An easy to read consent handout is available which may be useful to gain informed consent. You'll find this on the Online Centres Network website. It's also important to mention that individuals have the right to withdraw consent at any time by getting in touch with Good Things Foundation on legal.compliance at goodthingsfoundation.org. Once the person's given their informed consent, select the box and you'll then be able to proceed to record that support. Each project has a different set of questions and steps, so you'll need to check the exact steps you need to take in the project documentation on the Online Centres Network website. But in general, follow the on-screen instructions and try and answer each question as fully and accurately as possible. Some projects have different question sets for when you start supporting someone and after they've been supported. If you're completing an entry for one of these projects, check you've selected the correct stage before completing the questions. Sometimes terminology like baseline and impact surveys are used to represent the start and end of that support process. Once you've completed the screen, make sure you select the Save button. The button may be called different things for different projects, such as Submit. Once you save the screen, that support will be recorded within the Capture It system. So that's an overview of how you can use the Capture It tool to record support. Please get in touch if you have any difficulty or questions regarding the Capture It tool. The Good Things Foundation team can be contacted by email on hello at goodthingsfoundation.org.